Hey, um, so someone posted a picture in the Rapunzel community group um, of a rap very much like this, um, asking how to do it. So this is my version of how I figured out how to do it. I don't know if this is exactly what the woman did, but I do know that this is something that you could do with almost any scarf, um, and it's really super easy. Um, so this is the way I did it. So basically it's like a crisscross at the front and then kind of like a nice fancy poof. I'm using the gray, or I don't know if we call it pewter, shine, um, sparklicious. But you can do it with almost any long scarf, but obviously the sparkle is really nice and formal. So as you can see, it's basically like a waterfall twist. I'm going to deconstruct it. A waterfall twist, but with a crisscross at the front. Um, and then a really nice poofy thing. Much more simple than you would think by looking at it. So basically, I would tie it on my head at first on an angle. And you just want to make sure that angle is nice and flat. And then you bring around this end, also fold it so it really is nice and flat if you want to form, if you want to add some pleats, actually this just did a beautiful pleaty thing so I will leave it like that. Now what you're going to do is, I the key to this is that you want to tie it so that this end, the long end, I would normally tie my scarf like this so the end comes out, this comes out the back. You're going to tie it the opposite way which feels, at least for me, like kind of backwards. But you want this long end coming out the front, like this. And depending where you want the, that little poofy thing, you can tie it higher up or lower down. I'm doing mine a little lower down right now. Now I'm taking this end, folding all the fringes away, and then I'm gonna tuck it on the side right here. Now you can tuck it underneath if you want it to be more secure, um, or you can not. Um, some people find that that gives them a little more headaches, or it makes them, and some people find that it makes it feel more secure. Totally up to you. And now what you do is you take this end and kind of fan it out nice and wide, and bring it up along this way. So basically that's where you're creating that little poof, and you can adjust, adjust, adjust it. And then what I do is kind of take it like this, Fold it in. Do you want me to do it again? Did you see it? Yeah, uh, it yeah, okay. And then I take this end and bring it underneath, like right here. Tuck all those fringes away. And then this end, same thing, get it all gathered and neat. And tuck that in here and then you can make some adjustments i'm pretty happy with how this is looking maybe i'll make it a little poofier this time if you want it less poofy you can get it nice against your head um, but if you want it more poofy and different um different kinds of scarves also like um will create different kinds of poofs um, if a scarf is more stiff or thick, it'll create a larger proof. If it's more thin, like a two-in-one, I, I would love to see someone try this with a jersey. That would be amazing. I did it with a striped delight yesterday, and it looked fantastic. Obviously, a little more casual, but it really looked great. I think this might be my new go-to. So there you go. New wrap.